Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Physiology Learning. In today's Explain Why series, we are going to understand an important concept that is why cardiac muscle cannot be tetanized. We don't want the cardiac muscle to be tetanized because it will cause a lethal consequence to the person. Let's try to understand the reason behind it. There are two reasons which is behind the cardiac muscle not getting tetanized. The first one is it has a prolonged action potential. How does this prolonged action potential help its cardiac muscle to get not get tetanized? The reason is because by the end of the action potential gets over, the contraction you can see here, the above curve is a representation of the action potential in a cardiac muscle and below is the contraction in a cardiac muscle. As we can see here, by the end of the action potential, the contraction is almost complete and this is because of its prolonged action potential property. Since the action potential is taking more time, the end of contraction has happened. So, the second stimulus will not be able to generate a new impulse. And the second re reason is it has a very long refractory period. What is refractory period? A refractory period means a second stimuli will not be able to elicit any response in this period. And cardiac muscle has a long refractory period. And in this we can see here till this part. It is in the absolute refractory period. What is absolute refractory period? Whatever the strength of the stimulus is given, they will not respond or produce any new impulse in this absolute refractory period. So, the most of the time the cardiac muscle is there in the absolute refractory period. And there is a little part where it's, it is seen as there is relative refractory period. But again, during this relative refractory period, the contraction is almost complete. So, the contraction gets almost complete in the later half of the action potential duration. So, because of these two reasons, the cardiac muscle having a prolonged action potential as well as a long refractory period, it makes the cardiac muscle prevent it from getting tetanized and it is very very important for the heart muscle to avoid some lethal consequences. I hope it's clear. Thank you for listening. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much.